back in town. I just seen him leave Pedro's car with Camille. Ah, uh, I'm doing some side tricks from 05. Anyways, watch your back, yo. He's got immunity with Kelly. This silly old bastard doesn't even know he's gonna be sold out. Anyways, get back at me. <coughs> Any last words, nigga? Why are you trying to catch a body? Motherfucker cannot quit. All right, I'm gonna tell you what's up. You heard of the 22? Heard you talking shit about him. Now I'm trying to rep them by any means. Oh, oh man. Fucking initiation killing? Yes, my nigga. But hold up. If you knew about it, how did they catch your dumb ass slipping? But then again, that shit don't matter. Sorry, nigga. Wrong place, wrong time, wrong choice of words. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, maybe we can help each other out. I heard there was a reward for anybody who busts a cap on Camel Chad. And I'm talking serious money here. Stupid money, my nigga. How the fuck do you know about Camel Chad? Really? Was that necessary? No, I guess it wasn't, even though you've been wonderful tonight. Well, if you really must know, I just had a wonderful cuisine. But I really don't have an appetite for your sarcasm. Point taken. Okay, now what? Baby, you know I wanted to go to Malacones tonight. You know I like going there every other Friday. Motherfucker, I do not eat at the same restaurant twice. Any other concerns? <laughs> well? Okay, babe, wait up! Okay, driver, please take me to 127th and 15th okay, Avenue. Whoa, whoa, I'm the one that flagged him to stop. Okay, so I beg to differ because... Take us to 111th and 75th. I beg Brett, to differ. hurry up! Yo, I beg to differ because the first come, first serve policy is pretty popular on this side of the world. Please ask around, you'd be surprised at what you find. Listen, you're cute and all, but you need to go and find a cab that's available. Okay. <laughs> on this side of the world, common sense still rules. Keywords, common sense. Okay, so now why do I feel the need to raise the IQ around where you're seated? Your condescension compliments your charm. I'd say the same for your sarcasm. And by the way, please accept my token of appreciation. <laughs> Listen, I really don't... Hey, babe, what'd I miss? <laughs> this asshole is trying to take our cab. Henry? Henry William? Jeez, man, what the fuck are you doing here? Yeah, motherfucking Parker. <laughs> AKA the meat slicer. Looks like you packed a lot of pounds over the years, eh? Fuck you, asshole. <laughs> Hi. <laughs>
I see that you've lost some feathers off the top of your head, yet you managed to maintain your crustiness, you fucking featherless fruitcake. Okay, so take this in. I actually Facebooked your mom, and we got together, and she told me about your Pikachu flip-flops. Then she took care of me down there. But seriously, she actually took care of me down there. <laughs> hey, asshole. I take it you know this asshole? Jeez, we go way back. Camille, Henry, Henry, Camille, my girlfriend. The pleasure is all mine. Oh, that's an understatement. Uh, apparently, uh, I had something to do with this mm -hmm. earlier. Hey, why don't you come for drinks at my place after? Yeah, let's do it. I no problem. Okay. So your mother called last night. And? And she told me what she found under your bed. I didn't give her permission to go through my stuff. Well, let's think about it, Kellis. You leave your shoebox out in the open. That's how some of your cash got sucked up by the vacuum cleaner. Exposure. Then the popo come around here asking about you. Unwanted attention. So far we got exposure and unwanted attention. Do you want to tell me what the fuck is going on here? Well, I am laying low. I got too much heat on my ass. So, quitting the gang and skipping town would be two good moves to start? Ah. Don't you think? So, so, you were trying to tell me how to be an exit just It's 2014, not 1994. I worked the streets. I got that money and got out without being buried six feet under. And it cost my fucking brother's life. And you had nothing to do with it as well. It's because of your sloppiness that he got into this mess in the first place. I think we need to talk about what you're gonna do about the syndicate. Bitch, don't switch the subject. <laughs> Are we done here? <laughs> you sure, nigga? Yeah, man. Motherfucker's stacked up. He likes to stun all fucking week, yo. All you gotta do is pull up on a man, squeeze two, and take his shit. Fucking easy. Well, hold up. How the fuck do you drive there looking for Brent? Ooh. 